The Franklin County Dog Shelter is uh, bringing back the dog sleepover event for the holidays. People are allowed to foster shelter dogs over a holiday vacation. We love this idea. And today I am joined by three dogs. Kay is here. What's your name? Devin. Devin wasn't even supposed to be on set, but we <laughs> we have three dogs, so we need three hands here. Uh, so Devin, thank you for sitting no with problem. us. And Kay, thank you for being here. This is such an awesome program. How does this work? Well, everybody can come out. Anybody can come out to the yeah. shelter tomorrow. We usually start on uh, Christmas Eve, but we know people want to spend time with their families mm -hmm. on Christmas Eve. So we're extending the program. And they come out tomorrow, just pick a dog that they think would be suited for their family holiday and take them home over the holiday weekend. Let me see something, Kay. We're, s we're hearing that the microphone, I think, has probably been pulled off by, by a dog. dog. Oh, there, there we go. go. There we go. Okay. All right, so say it again. Folks can come down tomorrow yes. uh, to start taking a dog home for the holiday. And what does that mean? How many days will you have the dog? They can have the dog during the entire weekend. They come back like on Saturday. Okay. And we'll keep um, okay, <laughs> there we go. Just come back on, bring the dog back on Saturday, or if you want to keep the dog to foster for a little longer yeah. for an option to adopt, you can do that as well. Oh, that'd be awesome. And all you need is fresh water and a place for the dog to sleep. We supply the food, any medication the dog may, <laughs> may be on, and we give you a report card because we just want to know how the dog is in your home. Yeah. It gives us some more information to help us find a forever home for the dog when he comes back. And let me tell you, all of these dogs, as soon as they saw the camera light come on, they started to like calm down, except for this one because it's a puppy, right? They're all, yeah, yes. this one's a puppy, and Holly there that you have Holly's is a puppy, a puppy as well. Holly, you're doing yes. really good too. Yes. I mean, so all different temperaments of dogs. Yes. Um, and, and, this program has been so successful. When did it start? You haven't been doing it that long, have no, you? No, this is second annual. Last year we did it. The first time was on Thanksgiving, and we had no idea if anybody would even show up. Sure. And the uh, shelter had a circle around it of people, and we actually emptied the shelter. We had no adoptable dogs were left in the shelter during all three Isn't events. That awesome. It was. And and so you're hoping that that's going to be the case again? Absolutely. Yeah. We hope that we have <laughs> all foster failures, Hello. you know, during this event, and that all these dogs find forever homes. Yeah, Bob Nunley's a foster failure. Yes. Uh, so there are a lot of people out there that get these dogs in their homes and just can't can't bear to bring them home. And these are the, just the cutest pooches. You are just so cute and so sweet. Yes. So we have a lot of people uh, will participate. Again, you can foster shelter dogs for the Christmas sleepover starting tomorrow until Friday. And the New Year sleepover is from next Monday, December 30th to January 2nd. Is yes, that right? Okay, correct. so we've got a couple of holiday sleepovers going on right now. And it's not all about Christmas. Hanukkah sleepover too, folks. So let's do this thing. Let's adopt some dogs. Lots of pooches out there that need a forever home.